Christ. That's right. A lot of people don't know that. He's literally. Jesus I really Christ. liked him in Outlander. Did you see Outlander? Uh-huh. Nobody did. Did you see the? I saw Outlander. That's Vikings, right? Yeah, a yeah. Sp- spaceman teams up with Vikings to take down a, sp- a space monster that crashed his ship and destroyed his planet. Did you hear about Mel Gibson's Viking movie that was supposed to be shot and Leonardo DiCaprio like walked away from it after the whole phone scandal? He yeah. was like, "Okay, Mel, I'm done with you," and he just like walked away from it. That's a smart move. I'm not a Mel Gibson sympathist. I mean, I love Mad Max and all, but doesn't forgive his recent behaviors. Did you see... What was the movie? Uh, not Jim Caviezel. Guy Pierce. It was shot in Australia. It was just, just recent. recent. The Proposition. Yes, that's not very recent, but it's great. That movie's so good. Yeah, it, it was good. like five years ago, four years uh, ago? Oh yeah, a few years ago, and it also had... Um, What's his name from Train Spotting? Robert Carlyle. He was very good in it, as well as Jeffrey Jones. I really like his work, despite the fact that he's, he's a, a, a piece. Well, he's not a molester. He just had kitty porn on his machine. He had any machine. He did it. Wait, uh, you did it. who was he in? The, are you recording now? Oh, who was he in 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 the proposition? Which one was he? He was the older, fatter, red-haired dude. The guy from Beetlejuice. The like the the sheriff or whatever. The guy who's like he's they. The they and, uh, uh, oh wait, no, no, no. He's, no, he's, he's the uh, he's the live, he's the newspaper man from Deadwood. Yeah. And if you haven't seen Deadwood, you're you're worthless. The newspaper man from Deadwood. I fucking loved Dead, Deadwood, and yeah. I can't remember who. You t- oh yeah, I know who you're talking about. Yeah. That guy had kitty porn. Uh, something. I don't know. I can't remember the specifics. Some kind of. So did Pete, uh, so did Pete Townsend. Yeah, yeah. Well, that was research. According, <laughs> according to was, Pete. Yeah. The uh, proposition was great because the very, the very last scene where they're raping his wife in front of him, that was like I've never cringed that hard in a movie. Like that was like one of the most like. No wait, huh? I'm completely mixing this up. I'm thinking about Ravenous, not yeah, the proposition. A, totally I saw the proposition too. And yes, that, that's a lot more recent, but Jeffrey Jones is not in that, nor is Robert Carlyle. That one's about cannibals. They had a... Uh, they touched... The Wendigo, yes. Didn't they touch on cannibalism in the proposition a little bit? I watched that over the holidays with my folks, and I think we had a lot of eggnog, if you know what I mean. Is the show a fat neck? See, you got control room going up. All right. Right. That's Chris. Chris is awesome, by the way. Only, I need a, to sign a NDA or something. Right? But it's not up yet, right? Release form? Yeah, you want to, you want to release. <laughs> I don't want to 